Elixir aircraft is a fourth generation, Type 23, FAA certified aircraft. Uh, when I say FAA, we currently have the IASA Type 23 and we're going through the equival equivalency. So we estimate hopefully in the next 12 months we should have the uh, FAA certification. What makes the Elixir different is its uh, production. So we're using what's called carbon fiber one shot, which allows us to uh, make a very strong product, but without m using many parts. Uh, what we've learned from uh, basically the sailing boat industry, where the founder of the company, uh, Arthur Leopold Leggi, is a very passionate, avid uh, sailboat industry racer, and took the carbon fiber one shot model and brought it to uh, aircraft manufacturing. So for an indication, the whole wing of the aircraft from one side right to the other side is just one part, one piece. Same for the fuselage. What we've done by doing this is remove many of the parts where this could create failure, increase maintenance, uh, so less parts, less areas for failure, less areas for maintenance. To give you an example, the, the full fuselage and wings area here is 10 parts in total. The whole aircraft, 600 parts. If you compare this to something like a Cessna or a category Type 23 aircraft, you're looking at 17,000 to 20,000 parts. So this helps to incorporate many more safety features um, due to the fact of the reduction of the weight and helps for a massive reduction in cost of uh, operating. Uh, to give you an example, the operating cost of this aircraft is probably around $50 an hour. So we have two versions at the moment, 9112 uh, IS Roltax and 915 IS Turbo. So the 100 horsepower and the 140 horsepower. We're probably looking at first deliveries into the US market, uh, probably in 24 months' time. We are currently taking pre-orders at Oshkosh uh, this week. Flies very well, very, very stable. Feels like a much heavier aircraft than it is due to the wing design. Estimated pricing, again, we have to wait for the FAA approval because things may change, but the 9112 model, we're targeting 299,000 uh, US dollars. And for the 915 IS, IFR version, 399,000 US dollars. Avionics, uh, dual on the I IFR, dual Garmin G3X, GTN 750 and a G5 for backup. So for the 9112 uh, cruise speed, for the 915 you're looking at 160 knots, uh, 158 knots, burning about 9.5 gallons per hour. For the 912 uh, you're looking at 123 knots, uh, burning around 5 gallons per hour. They're both two-seater, you can easily put two guys, 220 pounds in there, plus two uh, luggage compartments behind which will take any carry-on, uh, airline carry-on standard luggage. So. The aircraft is uh, currently assembled in La Rochelle in France, in the west of France, where the company is headquartered. Elixir has plans uh, and will have premises in the US uh, from around August uh, 2023. Uh, we're based in Florida. So obviously we're at Oshkosh, this is our launch into the North American market. We have the aircraft here and we'd like anybody to come along and uh, see the aircraft, Boo 352, just behind Garmin.